Hey, how's it going? This is Kyle with DrFrankenFilm.com, and today we're going to spend a little bit of time talking about how to make your own black and white film developer Rodinol at home with stuff that you can buy locally. So here's what you need. We'll be using three chemicals for this developer. Sodium hydroxide in the form of lye drain cleaner, sodium sulfite available from a home brewing supply company, and 500 milligram tablets of acetaminophen. We will also need a gram scale, a measuring cup, an amber glass bottle, distilled water, and something to stir with. Make sure to read and understand how to safely work with these chemicals before starting. MSDS sheets are available at drfrankenfilm.com. First, measure out 50 grams of sodium sulfite. Add to 200 milliliters of water and stir until dissolved. There will be some particulate left behind. Don't worry about it, it won't affect the final solution. Next, measure out 20 grams of sodium hydroxide. Be careful to avoid skin contact. Stir into the solution until dissolved. The solution will increase in temperature. Don't worry, this is normal. Count out 30 500 milligram tablets of Tylenol. Crush the tablets and pour into the solution while the solution is still warm. After you're done mixing, pour everything in an amber glass bottle, cap it, and let it sit for 72 hours. At the end of the 72 hours, you can use it just like normal Rodinol film developer. Now, if you're unsure of the development times or what dilutions to use, you can visit the massive dev chart online to find out what works best for your particular film. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to email us. And for more information on this project, including MSDS sheets and uh, any other safety information, visit drfrankenfilm.com. Thanks for watching.